So, uh, I'm gonna be planting some beets soon. Try for a super early spring slash late winter planting. And this kale was in the way. And I was gonna pull it out like a week ago, but it looked like it was getting some new stuff on it. So I decided to just leave it till I was ready to plant. Um, <laughs> it looks hilarious the way it's grown out. But, I mean, they're really nice, tender little baby leaves. See how crazy this thing looks. So, one thing about cabbages and kale is if something happens to the top of the plant, it will start growing new ones out the sides. So, like, if you were to cut, instead of uprooting a cabbage, if you were to cut the top off, and leave the root and the stalk there. Not necessarily, but it would potentially start growing a whole bunch of new baby cabbages off the sides. Almost like how Brussels sprouts will grow like their little teeny tiny looking cabbages off the sides of the stalk. Not that many and not that small, but the same idea. So, if something happens to the top of your kale, like if it gets too frozen, or too trimmed, or damaged by pests, they'll start growing new ones out the sides, like this. So, these are all teeny tiny tender baby leaves. And there's no point in just throwing them in the garbage. So, I'm just pulling them all off, and I'll take them inside and clean them and put them in a salad or a soup or something because there's no point wasting perfectly good food side note about food it's one nice thing about composting is greens are never wasted if your kids only eat half of them and refuse to eat anymore or they're full, or they chewed them up and then decided they didn't like them and they spit them out. They're never completely wasted because you can always just throw them in the compost. There we go. Now, the funny thing about this, I don't know if you can hear it or not. I'll put up by the mic. Is It's very hollow. Like, obviously, it's still growing just fine. But all this through here, from about here up to about here, this is all just super hollow. I'm not sure exactly why. I think it's, it had some aphids on it earlier in the year, but eh. look at the inside of it. Kale. All kinds of little fibers and stuff. And that's interesting. I guess you can see it started to kind of rot through here looks like me so it almost kind of looks like some little bug Yay. was eating through the middle of it there not sure but the top was still intact <coughs> and I guess the fibers on the sides oh. were still connected where's your shoe <coughs> over there okay we'll go get it anyway that's what the inside of a kale plant looks like don't fall down the steps Warren just wait a second so kale never wasted.